Now we're familiar with uh, tzedakah charity, of course, by buying food, giving it to those who need. Here we're talking about packing the food. So tell us about what's the extra value doing it this way. So when you go to a manufacturer, a company, they have to make a profit, and rightfully so. When we're able to do it on our own, we, man we pack so much, we give out so much, we're able to buy straight from the importer and package it ourselves, saving up to 30% and making it cost-worthy to further help more families. So that's in terms of the economic side, but I believe that what it does to people who are connected, who come here and volunteer, packing, actually not just giving a, a, a piece of food over to someone else, that's also something important. Well, that's uh, what the education of children or anybody, the Jewish people, which we're all about, helping another person. So when you give a child, a family, an experience to help someone and teach them hands-on, it's very memorable and they live with it taking that lesson, part of learning in Israel, to continue giving and helping someone else. One of the special reasons why we opened up the center is lots of people come to Israel, they want to donate and help, which is, of course, very important, but they want to give as well, they want to do something, create something hands-on. And that's exactly what this project's all about. Sometimes uh, people come here just to be part of this important activity, and of course, their donation is great by actually helping, but sometimes you receive donations with families that want to be really part, financially speaking, with this uh, important charity foundation. Right, so actually we've developed a special project for bar and bar mitzvahs where they can make an online food drive and either prepare in advance to bring a financial donation, part of their bar mitzvah or bat mitzvah celebration, or when they come here, took videos and had a great time, they go share that with their family and friends at their bar mitzvah celebration back at home where they can collect money and send that back to Israel and help feed more families. What are the responses when you meet the, especially the young uh, boys and girls as they are, take part in this activity? Uh, I don't think one person has come through here and hasn't yet smiled. Uh, everybody loves it, it's a lot of fun. Everybody's all over the place making sure to help. Grandparents, little children, the entire family, it's fantastic. Those who receive uh, these food packages, do they uh, also know that this is a special project with people helping the packing and all? So that's one of the special things we have, that every package has a little name, for example, packed by the Traxler family from Houston, Texas. So a family that will open up their box and see that a family came here on vacation, took time out of their visit, and actually packed food for them. It's very heartwarming, letting them know that they're not alone. There are people around the world that care about them, even though they're not as fortunate as them. Um,